Peace and blessings in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed day for you. Blessed day for me. Blessed day to be in the presence of the Lord. And I just want to tell y'all about my dream about the National Guard. Um, I had a dream before the first dream. Pretty much they had um, come to Washington, D.C. And they were arresting people. I guess that was disorderly. And I saw them set up in a place near Southwest, uh, Southeast area. Um, and of course they did. They have been here. Um, this dream, this is my second dream that I had. Um, I was driving in a car and I was talking to my friend on the phone and when I pulled up to my house, I told her I was going to call her back and um, the National Guards were in their Jeep with guns in their hands and they suited up and they had um, like these little black masks over their face. Um, my son pulled up behind me and um, he came up to the car and was like, hey, can I borrow $40? And I was like, you always want to borrow some money. And we started laughing. And he was like, I would always pay you back. And I said, yeah, all right, come on. So we were going in the house. And my son realized that he forgot something in his car. So he left back out to go get it. And when he left back out, the National Guards got out the Jeep, came to approach him. And I guess asking him what he was doing because it was curfew time. And he told him, I just forgot something in my car, whatever. And, um... They wouldn't let him go back and get it. They just started beating on him or whatever because they wanted him to go back in the house. Now, I woke up um, after that happened. And what I got from the dream was, number one, when I pulled up to my house, um, I wasn't shocked. I didn't have any questions. I wasn't excited or nothing about um, the National Guards being there. It was like the new normal, as they called it. Um, they were supposed to be there. They were set up there. Um, and like I said, me and my son was laughing going in the house. So like I said, it was, it was just a normal thing for them to be posted up out there. Um, and then when my son uh, went outside and they beat him up or whatever for um, trying to go to his car, just showed that they were in control. They were patrolling the area. Um, and so, wow, just thinking about how they look, you know, nobody spoke or nothing. They were just serious, just standing in there or whatever. Um, anyway, um, we know that the government is looking to form a one world government, new world order, and in the near future, um, the nations will rise together, uh, ten kingdoms forming this one world government. Of course, the son of perdition, Antichrist, will be revealed, and all those things like that um, are going to happen. And we are so close in Revelation, and no one knows the date and the hour or anything like that, but we are so close just looking at what's going on in this world. So I just wanted to share the video um, because. In that time, the police won't have no place. They won't even have a place. So it's so funny they talk about defunding the police and all the things they're trying to do with the police. The National Guards are going to be controlling and patrolling things. So I just wanted to share that with you. Um, questions, comments, leave them or whatever the case may be. And I just praise the Lord for allowing me to see things um, that are going to come to pass. So have a blessed day.